Hi, I'm Maimon, and welcome back to my videos on the home security and video surveillance systems. In this video, I'm going to show you how to open up a uh, PTZ Wi-Fi smart camera. In this case, we have a high CU brand in order to view the inside and mainly to replace the SD card. So let's get right to it. The first thing we're going to do is they actually give us a handy dandy screwdriver packaged with the smart camera. and. Right now we're just gonna get to it. So just open up these four screws. I just gotta figure out the right place to put it. Actually it works really well. I remember when we first got this camera and we opened it up. I was trying to open it up with a screwdriver. My dad was like, why are you trying to open it up with a dainty little <laughs> screwdriver like this? But it turns out it's actually effective. Okay. So I think we'll keep that those in there for now. Okay. So let's get the grand reveal. And it turns out I didn't loosen this enough Hold on. all right let's take a look at what's under the hood all right so there's a rubber gasket right here for protection against the dust then all this wiring is pretty much exposed so you can see all of that right here's where the sd card goes like i said there, it, this camera doesn't come with an sd card already installed so this is ours actually let's see what it looks like and by the way this is a micro SD card, and it goes in just like this. It's going to be a bit hard from my angle, but oh, there we go. That's what it looks like. All right, so if you remember, in our first video, we talked about a bit of a, a quality issue with the antenna. You can see that, you can see what it looks like when I wiggle the antenna. And this nut right here is actually not helping it secure in place. So that when we spin the antenna in, it's going to make it a bit worse. We're not going to spin it too much. We're actually just going to overlay a picture so you can see just how bad it is. But that's a bit of a build quality issue, you know, plastic versus metal. All right, now I'm going to show you how to put it back on. Because like I said before, this gasket is a bit of a problem. This gasket, by the way, is for waterproofing. I think I said dust, uh, but it's for, for waterproofing. So the first thing we're going to do is going to try to make sure that the gasket is on in place. It will help if you push it down the screws. Putting the gasket on is probably the hardest part of reassembling this. Alright, so on second thought, and I actually thought this while I was doing it, but instead of putting it here, we're going to put it on the lip of the actual camera. So. right there and my dad no, did, uh, suggested this because he actually opened the camera more times than I did just put that in place then we're going to put the arm back on next step is to put the Longer screws, these ones, in first, and then put the bottom screws. Of course, put the piece on first. Okay. That's good. This is not like a car video. We don't have to over-tighten it. I mean, we don't have to tighten it by hand and then torque it. <laughs> okay. Not so bad. Now we're going to put in this piece. Actually, don't know what the purpose of it is. There probably is a reason for it. Maybe for secure, for securing it. Let's see if the screwdriver works because first time it didn't. Okay, so that's pleasant. Now for the second screw. By the way, I might, I just realized I might be scratching the plastic, but maybe this cover right here is preventing that, hopefully. And 
there we go. All right, so I'm Ayman. Today I just showed you how to take off the cover of a high CU or regularly, really any generic PTZ smart, smart Wi-Fi camera so that not only you can look inside, but mainly to replace the SD card and maybe to fix an antenna problem like this. In the next part, I'll talk more about the features of this PTZ camera, which I have a full packet of here, of it right here. So stay tuned for that video. And for now, I'm Ayman. Thanks for watching. Please like, rate, comment, subscribe, and look at other videos on I and Ayman. Especially keep a lookout for the uh, home security and video surveillance systems. And for now, that's it. I'm Ayman, and signing out. Peace.